Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back. So, new TCG banlist. Let's take a look. We, um, uh, actually, a lot of things happened. So, you know, Kashira was hit. Sky Strikers is kind of back with double engage and triple multi-roll. Um, uh, you know, Kashira is still there. I guess Sword Soul is still there. Sprite is still there with only two starter. Um... But you know, Super Heavy Samurai got like a big hit with their link. So let's see. Uh, one of the cards that I wanted to try out first was uh, was Danglong. Danglong um, finally returning to the TCG ever since, what was it, 2017-ish? Something like that. And um, you know, back then, I believe one of the stronger decks back then for us TCG players and same for the OCG was True King Dinosaur Yang Zing. Thing though is, is that um, uh, with the new support, right, from Wild Survivors, and, you know, we're like a couple of years later compared to, what was it, 2017 when Chu King Dinosaur Yang Zing was one of the top decks. Uh, back then, the deck kind of, uh, at, at like a high ceiling, it could do so much, but um, you kind of sacrifice some consistency in the main deck. And that's something that, even though Tang Long is legal again, I'm not so sure if you want to sacrifice some consistency, especially with the new support, uh, you have some space. To maybe fit in some uh, Yang Zing cards to, as you know, back in the back in the old school days, you were running what was it, Suan, Suano, the, the two of the level four, one of level three, and the the Chi Wen, the level one tuner, which is now in the main deck, because you know there are some combos, some lines that uh, could pump out the Baron with Chi Wen, etc. So that's why it's there. Plus, I am playing the trap card, the which is, it, nine pillars, right, which is basically an omni negation searchable off of uh, Deng Long. So. What I was about to say is that is it really worth it to main deck the the other Yang Zings, right? So what is it level back? No, it's not Baxia, the you know the, the level three one of the level fours to potentially you know quick synchro during your opponent's turn, make Herald. I mean the, those were the gimmick plays back then, back in 2017. But I I think now that I don't think it's worth it simply because the uh, you know the deck has other plays, the deck has much more consistent plays, especially with the new support. I think you can just, and I'm looking at, you know, like m most of the Yang Zing cards, like back in the old school days, back in 2017. I'm not, I don't think you want to do that, you know, sacrificing some consistency for those cards. But I think I'm only, only running nine pillars because again, it's searchable off of Danglong. Danglong is there. It's, uh, I, I mean, as you saw my build, I believe it was uh, earlier this week. Yeah, earlier this week with the new, you know, Transcend, uh, you know, Transcend support from a wild survivors where um the deck is kind of uh, kind of frightening especially with only one misc sadly no misc at three or maybe at two but the, the deck definitely needs misc at, you know, at least two or three but you know that besides the point so short set like i feel Deng Long definitely could have a place simply because it's so easy to make now you're not forced to main deck level one tuners as you were back in the day but now, you know, your Scrap Raptor is still there because of the new support from, uh, you know, the new set. Uh, you were running Scrap Raptor in the first place, you know, because it's such a high ceiling that you're adding to the deck if you're main decking those, uh, you know, that, that small Scrap engine. Uh, as for the rest, okay, that's something different that I uh, added in compared to my previous video is the True King engine. So, um, you know, the, the Earth True King, etc. Because now, I guess going first, the potential, if you have one of those Earth, True King, or Heritage, is, no, it's not Heritage, uh, Diagram, the True King Field spell, you could potentially destroy your opponent's extra deck. And, like, for example, looking at Kashtira, the fact that, uh, a, well, is, is, is it a Rise Heart, the, the Exceed? That uh, it's basically a Macro Cosmos, it's now at 1 with our new uh, Forbidden and Limited list, then the, the True King, the Earth True King, can just, you know, like destroy the entire extra deck from Kashira, for example. And I'm definitely looking at the branded as well. Like like the Earth True King is, is could be a tech for that. And uh, you know, on top of that, testing out Tang Long with that. Uh, but I, I need some more testing. Like there are some you know different routes in the extra deck. I'm looking at uh, Tsolkin, Ultimaya Tsolkin for maybe Crystal Wing. You know, the lines, those old school lines. Uh, I'm looking at Trishula. Um, sadly, there is no, um, whatchamacallit, the um, uh, True King of All Calamities, but there is. I'm running the rank 9 that, what is it, banishes one random card from your opponent's hand or graveyard, for example. Enter Blatinir, I believe that's the name. Uh, I, I guess it has a place. Also, um, 
as it you know as I was using dinosaurs on Monster Duel because again it's it's very similar on Monster Duel where you know Danglong is also available. Is uh, I'm running the what is it the level nine Shen Shen yeah Shen Shen I think the level nine synchro that I guess. It's just an extender. It's an easy level 9 synchro next to potential Trishala if you know you're main necking that one. You could make an easy rank 9 uh, exceed play, and, and that's the most important one, is basically follow a play for next turn, like banish your giant rex. And as you know, Shen Shen has like, what is it, when it attacks or when, when your monsters attack? You can, let's say, uh, take one of your banished monsters and send it back to the graveyard. So, you know, send back Misk, for example. Since I guess that's the biggest difference compared to my previous build, is I'm running uh, one less normal in the main deck, the level 6. Uh, you know, as you saw, like, in the previous video, or might have seen in the previous video, like, running that level 6 normal gives you rank 6 access, either the, the rank 6 Evolzar, you know, the one that, like, uh, destroys monsters upon summon, or their new rank 6 that, that what is it, banishes, a, uh, no, special summons one of your banished dinosaurs, which is okay. So I'm not so sure, it, it, uh, like between both builds, I kind of, uh, I was about to say, kind of prefer the first one, the one that I uploaded a couple of days ago, but I definitely see the advantage of Danglong and, you know, Danglong searching the Omni Negation, especially if you know you're going first, that's kind of cool, especially, you know, let's say you're, you know you're going first, your opponent's side attacking in Dark Rule or No More or stuff like that. You know, searching nine pillars definitely helps against that particular setup. Um, so going first again, have that level six. Well, I believe that that level six, the new one, is just fine as a one-off. I was playing it at in, at at, uh, at two my previous build, but you know, just one is fine. Uh, it's a nice extender. So going for cross sheep, cross sheep is still there. The fusion is nice again, one of the better cards. In, um, you know, looking at dinosaurs from the newest set, Savage is still there for a potential Omni Negation. Oh, this duel. <laughs> this duel. Oh, this was not fair. But, um, <laughs> uh, yes. Uh, anyway, so get out the fusion, you know, you know that the, their, their standard combo stuff. So send back my uh, my normal back to the deck to potentially um, going for what is it, Changing, the Sword Soul level 10. But again, there is like no way to trigger it during my opponent's turns, at least for me. So, I didn't see the point, so I, I, I feel this, this setup is fantastic, you know, you have Appaloosa with a couple of monster negations, Lagia for summon negation or, you know, spell and threat negation, Savage for Omni negation, plus, like, for example, against Kashira, uh Conductor is fantastic, you know, just put their monster face down and it pretty much always ends their turn. But uh, <laughs> Double Imperm says no. <laughs> yeah, what can you do, right? And this, this you know, even though that uh, Kashira lost Diablos, which is definitely a good hit, you know, it prevents like, well, does it mill half of your opponent's deck? That's, yeah, that's just not fun. Now it kind of feels more balanced. It, you know, it, it's still Kashira, you know, it does some, you know, unfair stuff, but it kind of feels doable. Um, so that's why Dark Ruler is still there, right? Like for me, at least, you know, for dinosaurs. Um, so I'm, I'm going to lose this one. I set my Dark Ruler, and it, it's not going to matter. You'll see my next draw. Um, so Savage indeed getting destroyed as well by the, what is it, the Dark Armed Exceed. Um, yeah, I probably should have kept the, you know, just in case, right? You never know what you're going to top deck, even though, yeah, I was about to say that Macro Cosmos Effect, but, you know, Potential Dark Ruler. And, ah, oh, the Normal is banished, by the way. Yeah, I think so. Otherwise, I could have used it, I think so, but, yeah. Everything is banished, right? But, you know, keeping it in the Dark Ruler could have been a bit different. But it is what it is. So, short set. The new ban list, Dinosaurs, they need more Misk. Uh, one and two, a Danglong could have a place. Um, but, you know, I'm still you know, exploring some lines featuring Danglong. So, again, all suggestions are definitely welcome. Okay? Guys, that's it. Thanks for watching. Feel free to leave a comment or like if you enjoyed the video. Leave a sign out. Peace.